Right, so today, lads, we're going to be reviewing Informed Christian Teo. Plays at FC Porto in the Premier League of Portugal. He's 5 foot 10 tall, right footed, he's got medium, medium work rates, 3 star weak foot, and 3 star skills. Looking at his in games, he stands out to his 90 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, 88 shot power, 86 agility, and 85 dribbling. I've also included all the upgrades over his non-informed version as a comparison for you. So you can see each individual stat increase of each individual stat. So you can always pause the video now to look at any of these. So this is the team we'll be using Inform Teo in. A gold and silver 4-3-2-1 Premier League team with Teo up top there at right forward. So now on to the gameplay. Starting off with pace. Now Teo is a speed demon on that right hand side. 90 pace now on his card. And he does have great acceleration and sprint speed. So he can get into top gear quickly and burn those defenders on the outside. But he's not only all about the pace though, he does have great dribbling and agility to go with that as well. So he is great for when you want to cut inside and take on the defence, when you want to try and get some shooting chances. And he does also have his 3 star skills, so he's not bad of course, obviously would be better with 4 star, but you can easily get by with 3. And when he does get into shooting positions, he's got a great shot for a winger, he's had a plus 7 shooting boost on card, so that's a massive shooting boost for EA especially, and that just makes him even better at right forward. So he can use his shot power, he's got 88 shot power, he can use that to smash the ball near post, or he can blast it across the keeper to the opposite far post. Now he does only have a 3 star weak foot, but to be honest, it doesn't really hinder him, he was using his left quite well. When he's forced on his left, he was finishing with his left, so we can't complain about his weak foot. And Teo was absolutely going ham at right forward in the goals. Two hat-tricks in his first two games, so six in two. So I instantly loved the informed Teo. His pace combined with that shooting makes him so, so good on that right wing. Now, he does only have 57 strength, so he can get bumped off the ball quite a lot against defenders. But saying that, he was using it to his advantage. He was getting in, in and amongst defenders in the, the, uh, in the box, and he was winning. He did actually win a couple of penalties as well. So when he gets the bumped off the ball, it can be an advantage when he is inside of the box, of course. Passing wise he's not too bad either so we can pick out his teammates with some decent passing off a link up play down that right hand side. So let's have a look at Inform Teo's performance stats. So in 6 games he scored 11 goals and got 2 assists. All the stats are on the left, goals are on the right and we got a position map showing you where the goals were scored and it's all assists were created as well. So overall we're giving Inform Teo a great 9 out of 10. Love using Informed Teo, as we said, great pace on the wing and even better when you combine it with his dribbling and his agility as well. And his course, he's got that great shooting up way which really makes him dangerous as a right wing or a right forward. I'd easily recommend right forward, he is a beast though. You want to try and get him into more of them shooting chances, as most shooting chances as you can, especially with his shooting. And he has a great scoring record, as you're saying for us, uh, 11 in 6 games. Is, uh, that's a more of a striker's goal scoring record. My only real little problems with him were with his strength and his work rate. Now he does only have medium, medium work rate. I would have preferred higher attacking on a winger, but we still get by. He's got decent attack positioning, so he does make some great runs. So we're just going to leave you now with inform tales, positives and negatives. Would we'll make a great choice for a Spanish team or a Premier League team. And now Premier League is blessed with some great wingers now. We've got uh, Inform Teo, Inform Salvio, Quaresma, Nani, Kelvin, and the, I could keep going on. Uh, the list goes on with wingers in that Premier League. And they're fairly unused as well. You don't come up against them all that often. So hopefully you did enjoy the review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. And please subscribe to the channel if you're new as well. Check out all our other reviews on the channel. We try to do the most in-depth reviews as we can. Loads more to come as well. So stay tuned for them. Cheers lads. Thanks for watching. And peace.